Here's the other thing I want people to appreciate. This is something I have enormous disdain for conservatives are. Do not take people and give them your children to raise oh, eight days, a, five days a week uh, who are you're, they're training their children to hate you. Yep. They re socialists regard your property as their property, but even no, more nefariously, they regard your children as yes. their property. You see they're getting resentful that there may be cameras in these classrooms. Yep. And it is a very sick, and this has been by design. They talk about making good citizens. Making good citizens is a euphemism for breaking young minds and making them uh, submissive and obedient and to have their self-esteem come from an external source namely that mediocre man or woman at the front of the room who your approval is based on whether they give you a grade and it's based on whether they like you or not more often than not it is a horrible prussian evil system that's been going on for 100 years and that is something that really needs to be the next front line among people who are who care about their kids now i'm just gonna say one more thing a lot of people don't have the option to go to private school of course that's where the fight needs to happen that money has to follow the kid there need to be more choices for poor people i was gonna ask you about school choice i, I mean i i'm a, for school abolition i say <laughs> i i have i have said i many, agree i have said many times public schools are literal prisons for children and the only place many people will ever encounter violence in their lifetimes. And we're told, this is a really sick one, it's good that you're bullied because it prepares you for real life. There is nowhere in real life where you are trapped for years with someone who is engaged in psychological warfare or physical warfare against you other than perhaps an extremely abusive marriage and in that case there are many venues to help you es escape it and transition to a healthy life whereas here there's every opportunity uh, every chance to close the door and make sure you do not escape it is depraved and what if the bully is your teacher well, the bully, I mean, the, no, no, I said this also. The teachers are the bullies. The teacher's oh. job is to break your spirit and make you submissive and obedient. Here's some things that have some good teachers. The, I'm, I'm sure you yeah. have some. Here are some things that are um, uh, we just take for granted that you think about. Your, why is it that everyone has to learn in the same way? Why is it that everyone has to be on the same timetable? Because it prepares you for life in corporate America, where everyone mm -hmm. just checks in at 9 o'clock, which makes no sense for you're self-employed. Why is it that everyone has to learn the same things at the same rate? None of these things make sense in a contemporary context, but we still do them. I agree. Abolish school. Yes, abolish I, public I, I, uh, I, I, and the government monopoly on schools.